We have a problem in life. When we have a problem, Allah says, Don't worry, with that difficulty, there is ease. You will never know what ease is all about unless you've been through difficulty. Those who have a beautiful life, sometimes they are still worried and depressed because they don't know what it is like to have suffered a little bit. So, Allah's blessing. He makes us suffer slightly so that when there's a little bit of ease, mashallah, you know, a man who's always driven a Rolls Royce will never know what it's like to ride a bicycle to work. Two ways of making them ride. One is the doctor tells you you're about to die. Allahu Akbar. And you need to ride to work. Immediately everything is given up. Why? Because we're worried about dear life. That's why. If you see people, subhanallah, I've seen a man who had a carrot and he was pretending like he's smoking this carrot and nibbling on it. And I told him, I said, my brother, what made you nibble on this carrot? He says, my doctor told me I can't smoke and a good replacement is a carrot. I said, Allahu Akbar, you stuff in your mouth with a carrot because of a doctor. But when Allah told you smoking is bad, then you didn't want to listen. Your own maker said it. Allahu Akbar, may Allah make us from amongst those who eat carrots rather than smoking cigarettes. <laughs> really? So my brothers and sisters, it's a reality. Whenever there is a person who has tasted goodness alone and they don't know what difficulty is about. There comes a time when they do not appreciate what they have. So like I was saying two ways. One is Allah snatches it away from you. So you now have nothing. So many people have climbed the peak in terms of materialistic items and then they've dropped down the mountain. They say it's easier to drop from the top than it is from the bottom. Allahu Akbar. When you're right at the top, a small movement and you roll down. And when you're at the bottom, they can kick you. If you drop, you stand up again and you're walking. Same level, mashallah. It's all about altitude. May Allah protect us. Another thing is when you drop from the top, greater likelihood of breaking more bones. When you drop from the bottom, I might have just hurt my head slightly. Just say, ouch, and carry on. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala protect us and grant us humbleness. So remember, sometimes Allah wants you to go down so that you appreciate the bicycle after you had nothing. Yet 10 years ago, you had the Rolls Royce. May Allah bless us. So Allah says, and I'm sure we know the verses, verse number five and six. Indeed, with every difficulty or with difficulty, there is ease. And indeed, with the difficulty, there is ease. Some of the scholars of linguistics, they have analyzed the statement and they say, Al-Usr is referring to the same difficulty. And Yusr, because it is common, is referring to a different point of ease. So this verse would mean that with difficulty there is ease and with the same difficulty there is another point of ease as well. Which means with every difficulty there are two points of ease. That's the mercy of Allah. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala alleviate the suffering that we are all going through in our own little ways. Remember it's a gift of Allah to keep you in check sometimes. To keep you calling out to Him. May Allah open our doors.